Good evening. You are now watching English News at 8. Keep watching. The Sarawak government has enforced the restriction of tourists from China immediately following the spread of the coronavirus novel. This was announced by Chief Minister Datuk Patinggi Abang Zariton Abangji Openg after attending Chinese New Year open house organized by the Progressive Democratic Party in Bintulu earlier today. Sebab penyakit ini tidak hanya di Hubei. Sekarang sudah merebak ke tempat lain di negeri China. Bermana kita terpaksa uh, membuat keputusan seperti tempat lain kita tidak uh, memudahkan mereka untuk datang ke Sarawak ketika ini. Okay. Oh, yeah. okay, keputusan kita buat pagi tadi. Jabatan uh, Kesihatan telah mengenal pasti satu tempat bangunan yang akan kita gunakan sebagai tempat kuarantin. Uh, he added the Sarawak government would also bring back the Sarawakians living in China and go through the quarantine process. Only 33 billion ringgit out of 660 billion ringgit oil revenue mined by Petronas was returned to Sarawak. Assistant Minister in the Chief Minister's Department, Datuk Sharifah Hasida Said Aman Ghazali said, if Sarawak were to have a hand in its own oil and gas resource since then, it would have been in a better economic position now to attain a high-income economy and develop the state by the year 2030. Such a statement was revealed by Sharifah during a forum on oil and gas entitled Seeking Economic Parity for Future Generations, Fight for Our Right or Fight It Right, organized by Suara Petroleum Group earlier today. She added the oil and gas industry in Sarawak now may only have another 15 to 20 years to go before it is overtaken and replaced by renewable energy. The General Operations Force GOF in Cebu rescued 30 various species of protected birds worth about 24,000 ringgit from a plantation at 2 km Jalantua off Jalan Nibong, Kanawit. According to Deputy Commanding Officer Fidel Nyambong, GOF personnel stormed into the house at about 4 p.m. yesterday afternoon after receiving a tip-off from the villagers. Various colorful protected birds have been found all caged up and identified accordingly. He added an Indonesian national who claimed to be the owner of the birds have also been detained for illegal possession of the birds after he failed to produce any of the necessary permits to keep them. And that concludes the English news for today. I'm Shira Abamanzo for TV Sarawak. Thank you for watching.